Hi everyone, um, this is just a really short tutorial on how to fix FRQ files or frequency files, I'm not quite sure which one's the correct pronunciation. <laughs> um, I was, you know, testing out my bank and I found one, so I thought, you know, might as well demonstrate me fixing it. Um, for those of you that don't know, FRQ files are these things, the weird files that show up <laughs> in, your, in your bank um, when you start using Utal. Um, they're also the, let me just control G, um, they're also these yellow lines <laughs> in your auto. And yeah, these things, these spikes, these are going to mess up the actual recording. So like, let me just demonstrate. Cool. Isn't it? Yeah, the lovely blugger <laughs> shouldn't be there. Um, FRQ files are Utawa's readings of your recordings because Utawa doesn't use your WAV files directly. Um, the little blips are caused when Utawa hasn't read your sample correctly. Um, for fixing them, there's actually a few different ways. Um, sometimes you can just go in, go, oop, oop, wrong one, not this one. <laughs> uh, tools, voice bank settings, and then go initialize frequency map, and sometimes that'll fix it. Um, <clears throat> other times it just keeps it the same though. Um, if you're using version 4.04, whatever, of Utau, um, the resampler that comes with that is actually not as good as generating FIQ files as the 2. Point whatever version. So maybe like switching back to that uh, resampler can actually help prevent these. Um, if neither of those things work though, there's a way to just do it manually. So what you do is you go into Tools, Space settings, edit. And um, okay, this is the, it's kind of buggy because like these buttons are really important, but you can't actually like bring it down to see them properly. Um, the, let's see, the problematic example is at the end here. Oh, mm, um, you select a point before the icky bit and a point after that, and then hit this button here. I don't know if you can see it. I think it says AVG for like average, but I can't see it, so <laughs> I don't know. Um, clicking that will sort of like straighten out the the line, and then hitting right, and then hitting close, and hitting OK, that'll fix it. So let me just replay this. Cool. See? All better. Okay. <laughs> Um, my bank, well, Akiharu is going to be released, um, on the 8th, my birthday. Um, if, if there are any errors that I've missed, I'll be re redirecting you to this video if you, you know, tell me there's a problem. <laughs> and here's how to fix it, yeah.